Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to another video. Slightly more cheery one. Nobody's crashed into my car this time, so um, yeah. But no, random road trip. I said in the previous video, I at Japfest maybe a month or so ago, I bought a Nissan 300C from a good friend of mine, Simon. He was an absolute legend. He's kept it until now. So thanks man for that, really appreciate it. Sorry for fucking you about. Um, heading down to York now. Gonna go and stay in York tonight, have a nice hotel, and get the car in the morning, and then drive back up to York again, have a lovely day there, then home. So I thought I'd bring you along. It's really dark, it's, I don't know, I think we're meant to be at the hotel now, but we've still got an hour to go, so food's flat to the floor. So that's a hotel over there. They've actually given us, us our own like apartment. <laughs> it's pretty mad like. And the truck's right there, so I can keep an eye on it. That's not actually too shabby, like it's a bit of a weird setup. It's not too bad at all. Well, I'm away to sleep guys. I will see you on the flip side. Oh, oh. <clears throat> Oh, that's better. Yeah, close one there. So that's us ready to rock and roll. Let's get on the road. Well, we're here. Is there a choke or is it automatic? Might be injection, I think. Possibly. Don't have a clue. Straight away. Let's see if we can get out of the hedge. I might get out of here eventually. <laughs> Maybe not. Noise. That was a bit disappointing. Well, after many, many hours of driving and missing Flamingo Land, sorry, Amy, and um, we're nearly back. Car still in the back, but yeah, um, I'm going to unload it soon. Sorry, multitasking, just going around some really sharp corners at the car bar. But no, I'll, um, I'll get a little video of unloading it and just be a basic show, show around and let you see what I have wasted yet more money on. Um, but yeah. These would be some pretty good corners to drift. <laughs> Maybe not in the recovery truck though. Well, that wraps this video up, guys. I'm just sipping wine out of Jack Daniel's glass because I'm classy. But no, um, the Nissan, I've actually, I've had it maybe five days now or something. It was the weekend I picked it up just past. 
and it's brilliant. It's actually faultless. It needs a set of front pads. They're a bit fucking. They're a bit low, but you know what drives it? it? Drives mint. Honestly, I forgot how good '80s cars that have been looked after drive. Like it's ridiculous. It's so comfy. I've been up to Edinburgh two or three times with it, and it's never missed. Never missed a beat. Um, I serviced it as well. The fuel filter was really, really hard up. Actually, I'll chuck that in now. Just changed the fuel filler, but I'm laughing. Look at the colour of the stuff coming out of this. Oh, you see it's cleared up a wee bit. You should have seen the crap. There's big lumps coming out before. There we go, there's some more lumps. It was running a bit crappy, I was wondering why. It's a new one in. And the fuel filter's pretty hard up too, like. So, swap that out as well. Yeah, so, you see what I mean. Um, obviously the air filter was pretty crusty as well. Oil wasn't too bad, but the oil filter was ancient, so God only knows when that was last serviced. But I've got a set of plugs as well. I ordered plugs for it, I probably should have specified I need six, because it's a V6, but they sent me four, so that's why I didn't do that. But no, it's a wee bit lumpy on idle, but I don't think it's too much to be fair. Rust-wise, it's minted. There's a wee bit of surface rust on a few panels and that, but I mean, there's never been any welding underneath it. It looks really, really, really good. Um, obviously the plans are to slam it on a set of 15s or something, probably SSR Mark 1s, most likely. Seem to have a wee bit of a thing for them. Um, but no, just gonna see what happens. It's a temporary daily until I sort the Lexus. Um, like I said, I had bought it way back in start of last month or whenever it was um, and a shout out to Simon yet again thanks man I've fucked you about all month we met and pe meant to be picking it up meant to be not picking it up and then just never come in and whatever else you are sound thank you man appreciate it um, he's actually got a really really cool estate version which I'll chuck in now And that's a manual, which is even cooler, obviously. I think that's possibly coming up for sale as well. Don't quote me on that. But here's his Instagram anyways. Um, but yeah, so like I said, plans slammed. Nice wheels. Perfect. The next video will be the Lexus getting dragged in. I need to fix it. The spot it got crashed into outside my house, it hasn't moved. So I think I've just been a bit sad. I think that's what it's been. But no, I'll get that loaded up and to the garage this weekend. Really need to sort the solar as well, but you know how it goes. But yeah, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.